Hi, it's Christian here and welcome to another fly tying tutorial. Uh, this time it's gonna be the, this little fishy thingy I came up with because uh, recently I bought a new material, uh, this one. This uh, crystal and trilobal fibers in he Heckle 10, it's called. I actually did some uh, research and I found it on the, on the, on the web and it's uh, available out there. Um, I bought it and uh, used it for another fly and liked the material, so I wanted to make another one. And uh, that ended up in uh, this little fishy. Uh, the idea was to make a uh, si similar to a STF uh, fish. I've used STF, oh, STF uh, on this one as well, but I also like the green stuff that, that this, uh, this green fluorescent, fluorescent stuff there is in this. I like that, so I wanted to combine that with the with the STF, and that ended up as this. So, materials are are of course uh, starting by a hook, the uh, NS110 streamer hook in size six, and I use a uh, black uh, thread. This is the Vivis uh, DSP 50 Dinyard in black, and some uh, 10 STF uh, dubbing. This is from Flightco. It's really nice uh, color and some uh, 4mm living eyes uh, from fish skull. This is the wind color, earth color would do as well or whatever you like. Just some small eyes but these are nice. Uh, and of course some, uh, some weight set because I'm gonna attach the eyes with some UV resin. And that's about it. Not many materials, and you'll get a very lifelike um, uh, little fish. I decided to um, to paint a little bit on the back of my. You can see it on the photo uh, in the beginning of the video. And on the back of my little fishy here, with a with a brown marker. You could just leave it out if you don't if you don't like it. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it's up to you. So, without further ado, let's get the uh, time. Here we go. Okay, now we're ready. This is the one we are aiming for, the little fish. And um, the hook was the, the NS110 uh, streamer hook in size 6 from Aries. Just put on my uh, black uh, GSP thread uh, all the way to the back here. I'm, I'm going to start by making a little... Uh, tail by, with some uh, STF dubbing from uh, this is Flyco uh, in tan color and um, I start by grabbing a little bunch of the of this uh, I don't need very much a little bunch of this and aligning the fiber by putting them on top of each other over and over a few times that's gonna give you a little tail. I don't want, want too much. Something like that. And tie tying that. I'm gonna use the rest of this up here just to make a bit of a bolt, a little, little bit of a, yeah, you know, shape the fly. But I'm not gonna tip tie it all in just leaving room up here about a centimeter or so no not maybe eight or nine and millimeters up front here for it because up here I'm gonna put the eyes I'm gonna go back you can always if you're not uh, completely satisfied with your tail just do a bit of I don't want it too long, so I'm just gonna keep it short. There we go. And it's time for this stuff. The crystal and trilobal fiber heckle tan. And i um, gonna grab a piece of this and just in the end just get rid of the these uh, 
fibers what a way we, we call it dial in it's quite fast it's fun i like a fly fast fly this is, this is a fishing fly it, it's gonna look good in the water when you get squid go all the way in the front with the red i'm gonna cut off a 15 centimeters of of the haggle stuff and it's just all about moving forward nice and slow while always uh, pulling back the materials while i move ahead or while i move, move it forward, forward yes and it's gonna look like, like a freaking mess in, a, in about 20 seconds. We got these fibers all over the place because, uh, uh, yeah, it's gonna look a bit weird, but we're gonna sort it with the scissors. But you can see the green, the green stuff in it. It's gonna be good. Good looking in the water, we get sweat, and it's gonna be mixed with some STF killer combo. I think there we go. And then I'm gonna end up here. Material and just uh, secure there. So, this is the mess I was talking about. Then uh, it's time for, for the scissors. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, cut like this so we, we leave, uh, we get the shape of the, of the fish. So we cut. So it gets a cone shape the this whole body body. I'm gonna do it all right all the way around so I'm gonna rot rotate my vice. Now it's, it's a bit longer up here in the front, at least that's the plan. Um, and shorter in the back. Gonna just have to watch me do a bit of cutting here. Could, uh, you could uh, just leave do it even more, more uh, leaving more up, up here in the front than I did uh, if you wanted more um, volumes put more volume on your fly then this, this is uh, up to you that's up to you I guess then it's time for the STF uh, tan again uh, and I'm gonna grab a bunch again don't need very much though and uh, put them on top of each other again 
the fibers by aligning them over and over and over. And then you're going to take a bunch, and this is too much. Spread it out. Up here. And then two loose wraps, so I'm just going to... Pull back. I'm going to try to get the material all the way around the hook. You see this most of it on the top of the hook, but you got there. And then you're going to give it a brush. So you get the like a fish shape going here, and then when this get, gets wet, the, the STF is gonna blend in with the, with the what's it called, the crystal and trilobal fibers uh, underneath. That's at least the plan. Just gonna get this up there. This got fibers everywhere. And now I'm going to create a base up here for the eyes. I've tried just uh, putting the eyes on the thread up here and uh, it's going to be a mess. So it's hard. So I'm just going to like create a base for touching the eyes. I'm going to just add a bit of, just a bit of uh, STF dubbing up here. this Finish. And then I'm just going to take the, the small fibers that are up here. I could use some uh, lighter if they ever worked. Fast to get the small fibers here uh, off, burn them away so when you attach the, the UV resin as I'm gonna do now, they're not in the way. Um, now it's time for some, uh, for some resin, some UV resin. I'm gonna use this one, this one, the gray tap. I'm just gonna get, get it sorted. And then a, a, a set of four millimeter living eyes uh, from, from fish skull, these ones. And uh, I'm just gonna add a bit of resin here. One. 
than the other one. Actually quite a nice uh, fish many many years ago on the uh, on an STF fish I saw a guy called Martin Valeur he made a a, a, a a fly that was called the we called the STF uh, Gobi in English at least we made that one and I made it all uh, mine looked horrible at that, po at that time but we went to uh, a place called Jewish once. And I was really green as a fly fisher. We were fishing all day and during the winter and it was freezing cold. And I was st stood there in my cheap waders and uh, my <laughs> was really freezing my ass off. And then I saw a, we saw a big uh, sea trout uh, jumping out the water. And my friends, they let me uh, go out and uh, uh, cast. I was really poor at ca casting. But nevertheless, I managed to hook up the that sea trout, and it was a sil complete silver bar uh, that inhaled that ugly uh, STF fish I made, uh, and it was a 60 centimeter uh, silver bar. I never forget it. And uh, yeah, this gives you the flu of uh, fly fishing and uh, fly tying, and yeah. But this one is similar to it. But just with a bit of different uh, materials. Then the eyes are attached, and I'm gonna attach them a bit, a bit more. With different, different um, resins here. This is a really thin one. This is nice for getting into the material. Really securing those eyes so they are not going anywhere. And on over here as well. See if I can fa find a picture of that of that fish. Put in, in the rest in a put in the video here at, at the end of it, and you can see it. Then uh, there was uh, some red uh, UV resin I put in here uh, to add. Uh, yeah, don't know if it works, if it matters to burns, but it's a uh, yeah to create kind of a gilds uh, effect. A bit of. Bit of uh, this red stuff from from the race up really nice. Just gonna build up a little bit of down here. We have not much. Nice and slow. Yeah, that's fine. really thin one to make those eyes pop out or go crazy. in here down in the bottom so I'm just gonna keep turning Here. 
better to use a, a figure figure of the figure viscosity on the on the uresin and building the heads. The very last layer of uresin you put on should be the thinnest one, just to make a smooth and perfect perfect finish. Well, you've seen enough of this. At the very end, I'm gonna take my brown pin. Good, uh, just uh, not do it. It's up to you. So, so just like paint there, or maybe another color, black one. I don't know. It's you. There you have a little, a little fishy, um, made from a little bit of tan STF and some trial crystal and trial local fibers, heckle in tan color, and some Yuri uh, resin. Hope you like the movie, and will I will see you uh, next time. Stop by my channel and have a look at some of the other uh, tutorials I've made and please leave a comment and maybe even subscribe. I will see you next time. Bye bye.